Hey everyone, it's Burger Boy. And Ivan. In this video, we're playing Arcade Tycoon in Roblox. Ivan already got his game started. This is a second take because I forgot to mute the game, and Ivan's already got his going. So, we're gonna get $30,000 for a gumball machine. That's an expensive gumball machine. Wow, I'm making thousands off a gumball machine. Cha-ching. Cha-ching. So oh, it's cool. You can have visitors, but these ones, they aren't players. They're computerized players. M I mean, NPCs, which stands for non-playable characters. Oh, it is famous visitor. So you can have a famous visitor, and I think it's the creator of the game. I believe that guy is the creator of the game. Oh, okay. I'm checking right now. Oh, it's not script swag. It doesn't match his current avatar at the time of making this video. But it's cool. I think that's someone else. So you can have, I think they're based on other, like, famous Roblox users. So it's cool you can have visitors, and they can give you bonus money. I promise you that. Yeah. So you might be wondering, what happened to the arcade videos? Those ones... I think this one named him... I mean, his arcade text cannot be blank. There was this glitch I had where it wouldn't set, say its name, it would be blank. So my arcade. So there's the more machines ones, like upgrades you can purchase for Robux, like more famous visitors. Well, one of them I recognize, that's Stickmaster Luke. In my unboxing, I got the toy of him. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. So, the, the, those one. Hey, I see one of them is Dennis Di from Dennis Daly. Isn't that cool? Like, Dennis Daly? He's a Roblox YouTuber. Oh. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to use the customize. Oops. Not red. I'm going to use pink for all of these. It says material you can choose. It's not out yet. So, I'm going to try name it. Oops. See, look at this, the glitch, it's blank. I was trying to name it Poppy's Pink Cade. Like this, do you like the idea? I do. Even though the only thing right now is a gumball machine. Oh, look at this. Wow, that is a pink room. Yeah, it is. It's because pink's my favorite color. Pink's not just a girl's color. You're allowed to like pink even if you're a boy. So that's pretty cool how you can have people visit your arcade and they give you bonus money because like they spent money on one of your machines. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. So, and look at this, there's a prize counter on your arcade, like this, isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. 
so you can redeem your tickets for prizes. And there's this a cash register, a cash register with a sunglasses, candy that looks like Starburst. Uh, that might be bubble gum. That's cool. How you have a prize counter? Don't you agree? And we'll get this. No, if I, if you could stop and like, sorry, we don't accept bacon hairs. I know it's called the pal hair, but that's what the joke is. Because it looks like bacon. It does look like bacon. So, I think I have enough to get a claw machine. Win a prize. Thankfully, oh, like this, you can't close this, but thankfully it doesn't impede your progress too much. Oh, so okay, thought I bumped the webcam like that. Or my desk. So yes, famous visitor, it's the guy I forgot who it was based on, but that's cool. Famous visitor. One of them is Dennis Daly. I know his tons. Oh, this guy. Look well, at his two famous visitors at once. Awesome. Hey. Oh, yes, I think this guy. He's got some blonde, trekky hair. That's the same one I use. I bought some Robux to get it, and I updated my avatar because I want to make it like a Robloxian version of Yo Me. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. Like a mini me. So you can upgrade your machines if you don't have like don't have any room. So. Instead of focusing on new ones, you can upgrade your machines you already have and they'll give you more money. Isn't that cool? So it's once the bar fills up on there, it will pay out your money. It will add the money to your counter or your amount there. Isn't that cool? Yes. Yeah, I know. So it's the claw machine. They're all the same. All of them are the same things that are on the prize counter. Oh, gum on machine. Oh, well, I guess you're stuck with a gumball machine. Why could be? Keep upgrading that. Oh, and that race visitor. Oh, wait, this guy. You'll be funny if he just said to him, sorry, we don't accept noobs. Because look at this. He's got a noob visiting his arcade. He Hopefully he doesn't money. mess anything up. Does he have any money? I'm not it's sure. That automatic. That's one of the stereotypes of noobs. Like, the, some people consider them like people who don't have... Robux. But that's not me anymore. I know Roblox adopted the term and they made it a character. So that's cool. People can vi cool people can visit your arcade. Don't you agree? Mm -hmm. Oh, I wonder if I can only have a max of two games or something for the space that I have. I don't know. This saves your game? 
Yep, this game, I think, auto saves. So uh, you can. Come back and see, oh. see if your game's glitching. Yep. So this game is one that you can save your progress and you be left. So you pick up or continue where you left off. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna run the prize counter while you... I'm gonna run the prize counter. It, well, yes, it's like I'm in place of the poor bear. <laughs> it's cool. Oh, oh, it's a sheep. Look at this. When you do like this, it's like you have tiny sheep ears. Don't you agree? It's cute. Yeah. Welcome to Poppy's Pinkade. I'm gonna read people. Oh, never mind. This game is pretty fun, isn't it? I think so. Pretty cool. Oh, you're back? Oh, you got some good money. Now I have. So I'm gonna build an arcade cabinet. What oh, you? Now I'm having the same glitch you are. Just gonna wait a minute, and then it will let you Oh, there we go. I just had to drag it over there. Yes, this game, it looks like Geometry Dash. On there, it's cool. How, look at this, they're arcade cabinets. Isn't that cool? Thankfully, you don't have to get rid of your machines if you want to move it, because you can use the... It's because you can use move to move. It's like if you accidentally chose a spot you don't want, you can move it to where you want it to be. Or if you want to move stuff around. Look at this. This guy's been visiting my arcade quite a bit. I think some of them might be models from players that are in the game. At least this is a cool little town is. At least you can see, I think they walk through, they come out of the tunnels on the sides. They go through, I think, the sidewalk. The sidewalk. That's pretty cool how you can have players visit your arcade. People visit your arcade. Don't you agree? Thankfully, I think it's equal for all of them. It's not like the best person will get, get it. It doesn't matter how good your arcade is. So you can have it really just a gumball machine and people can... <laughs> Look at this, what he's doing! Oh, like, that's not how you play an arcade game. He was literally standing on... He was literally standing on the control thing. So I just... My things... I mean, my webcam... Keeps falling. So I'm gonna build some more gumball machines. Looks like it says you can only have three, like certain amount of gumball machines, like for the like the gumball machines. Oh yes, now I got one level twenty-two. Isn't that awesome? Oh, yeah, I know. This famous visitor. This guy's been visiting my arcade fairly often too.
Willis. Another noob visits my arcade. <laughs> I know you can't make them like that anymore due to the default clothing update. Like that, people don't like it because for the fact that. Oh yes, more noobs visit my arcade because it makes it impossible to make classic Roblox avatars like that. Like just the colors for that. So, if you're not wearing anything, it will say like. It will. Will say like. Default clothing's been equipped. What is it? What is that saying? Mm -hmm. That's what I was saying, the default clothing update. So, like if you try and make a classic Roblox avatar like that, you will, it will give you the default clothing. So that's why people don't like it for the fact it makes it impossible to make classic Roblox avatars. Well, yes, we've got an Outrageous Builders Club member on the server now. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. I'm done, right? Now. I'm done. So this is a pretty cool game because it's a bit different than most tycoons. So that's it for this video, thanks for watching.